Hi babies and welcome back to my channel. In today's video we're going to recreate this beautiful Charlize Theron inspired look from The Huntsman. So I was so happy when I saw the trailer and the first things that really got stick into this mind was Charlize Theron gold lift eye that kind of like starting from her hands and losing all the gold and just raising up into the sky and I was just like I need this in my life. So I was so happy that the movie is coming out this week that I was just like, it's about time to look like Charlene Theron and never age. So if you guys want to recreate this look, please keep on watching. Always remember to give me a subscription and a like if you like this video. But before we go, it's time to announce the winner of my first ever giveaway. There it was the Clinique Sonic. So I look hella dark next to this baby. So I'm just gonna like get rid of it because I look like an oompa loompa gone crazy. And the winner is this beautiful person, this beautiful girl called Sibylicious. I'm gonna leave the name down below and I'll be in contact with you, my love, and I will send the prize to you. Anyway, guys, please keep on watching and. Mwah! Have fun. So the first step to look like Charlotte Theron is foundation. And the foundation we'll be using today is the Per Minerals Veil and it's the one with liquid crystal. I'm going to spray a little bit at the back of my makeup box on London palette. Yes, so we got some foundation here. And for brush, I'll be using my old trusty Real Technique brush. So we are taking a little bit of this foundation and we're gonna come through. Come on. For concealer, we'll be using LA Splash Concealer and the color is Creamy Beige. So let's put this one pretty much everywhere. And now we're gonna blend 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 with the same brush so we're gonna kind of like push it into our skin for contouring today we're gonna use a cream and we want to keep it really really soft and i'll be using pure sculpture by mac And I'll be using my Beauty Blender to blend everything. And I'll be setting all my highlighting point by using a Beauty Powder by MAC in the color Hot Sensation. And for the rest of my face, I'll be using my old trusty Studio Fix Powder in NW25. For a little bit of extra highlighter, so a little bit of something zompum, we're gonna use Undress Your Skin by MUA in the color Pink Shimmer. It's now time for the fun part, that is the eye look. So I'll be using MAC Longer Wear Paint Pot in the color Lane Low, and I'll be applying this one as a base everywhere into my eyelids. Now we're gonna blend, blend, blend everything, making sure we can't feel any more the cream. So the first color we're gonna be using is Kid by MAC and I'll be taking in a nice fluffy brush. What we're gonna do is actually work it on our crease. So we wanna make sure we get a little bit of definition before we're putting our loose gold. So let's go for it. Into our eyelids, we'll be using the color Gloom and we'll be wetting our brush in the most traditional way, like so. Sorry. Now 
It's finally time for the fun part and we're gonna start with our gold. Into my eyelids I'll be using Ilamaska Broken Gold and for the rest of my face some crafting broken leads. So let's start. I think I will carry the way. Alright, I'll be using Fascinating by MAC in my waterline. So, just a little bit here. I'll be adding a little bit of kid eyeshadow on the lower lash line. For the lips, I'll be first thing going with Dervish Lip Pencil by MAC. Next, I'll be pressing on the same eyeshadow, there is Glim, just on the center. Lastly, just the end of the highlighter, because we need it. And this guys concludes our makeup tour for the day. Thank you so so much for watching and always remember, like if you like, hate if you hate, and until next time, you're welcome. <laughs>